Would you please make your way to the mobile police van, John Watson and Anne Simpson. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Sergeant Loftus from the British Irish Parachute and Space Team, the Red Devils. If you now look skywards, you're about to see five members of the Red Devils exiting the aircraft. Please give a big cheer. Today's display is going to be made up of uh, five regular soldiers from either the 1st, the 2nd or the 3rd Battalion, the Parachute Regiment. They've exited the aircraft. They've reached speeds of 120 miles an hour. They deploy their parachutes and they come safely landing into the cross at the top end of the arena where you see the smoke. Or they may do a crowd line spread. Now the first guy down is going to be our team leader, Corporal Nathan Conway. He was in charge of all safety for today. So when he arrives on the ground, please give him a big cheer. He's going to be followed by our one and only Scottish representative on the team at the moment, Sergeant Mike Scobie, but I'll introduce him in the second. Here we go, from the 1st Battalion, the Parachute Regiment. Corporal Nathan Connolly, everyone. Following him is our only representative Scotland on the team, Sergeant Mark Scobie, a big cheer for Sergeant Mark Scobie, everyone. Now it's predominantly going to be a flag this way today. First flag down, flown by Corporal Shorthouse, is the flag of the Parachute Regiment. So when he comes to land into the arena, please give a big cheer for Corporal Wayne Shorthouse, everybody. Charles has landed safely down. Following him is going to be Corporal Mike French from the 3rd Battalion, the Parachute Regiment. He's proudly flying the Union flag today. So please, everybody, put your hands together for Corporal Mike French, everyone. And I'm thinking we may have the biggest cheer of the day here because Corporal Chris Sharman from the 2nd Battalion, the Parachute Regiment is proudly flying the Scottish flag into the arena for you today, everyone. Please give a big cheer. Now what's going to happen next, ladies and gentlemen, is the men of the Red Devils are going to remove all their parachutes and equipment. They're going to perform a military-style lineup for you. Where Councillor Burrow is going to come out and meet the team. As he does, I'm going to introduce each member of the team and talk a little bit about them for you. How will be doing that? 
there's some people in the audience who think, well, who are the Red Devils? Well, they're the official team, the official football team of the British Army. They were formed in 1964 and became the official team in 1979. And we still hold that title today. How do you get to be a member of the Red Devils? Well, firstly, you have to join one of the three regular battalions of the Parachute Regiment, either the first, the second or the third. To be become a member of the team, you have to do at least three years in your respective battalion, at least one operational tour, and then you can apply to come on a selection process with the team and join us that way. Now, if that feels a little bit long-winded to you and me, you still can jump with us. You can sign up for one of our bespoke tandem days with the Red Devils, everyone where you come down, strap yourself to one of the guys that you see in front of you, exit an aircraft at about 12 and a half thousand feet, reach speeds of 120, 140 miles an hour. They would then deploy their parachute at about 5,000 feet and bring you safely into land. So if you do fancy that, ladies and gentlemen, please go on our website, www.reddevilsonline.com. Likewise, if you are interested in joining the Army, then there is information on that, on our website, there's links and several ways of where to go to get all the information that you do require. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to introduce each member of the team as the councillor comes out and meets them. Now, taking the line up today is our team leader. He's from the 1st Battalion of the Parachute Regiment, and that is uh, Corporal Nathan Connolly. So he was in charge of all the safety aspects in the sky today. So a big cheer for Corporal Nathan Connolly because he's the guy that made that display happen for you. Okay, a slightly biased crowd. A big cheer for our Scottish representative, Sergeant Mark Scobie, everybody. <laughs> okay, following him in the lineup will be uh, Corporal Wayne Shorthouse. He's from the 3rd Battalion, the Parachute Regiment, and he's one of our canopy formation experts. Next in the lineup will be Corporal Mike French. He's also a canopy formation expert, so what you do see on YouTube or on our, on our webpage, the, the collision of canopies in the sky, that's, that's how intentional, and these guys train really hard to do that. So please, give a big cheer for Corporal Mike French, everyone. Okay, next and last, but definitely not least, is uh, Lance Corporal Chris Jarman. He's from the 2nd Battalion of Parachute Regiment and he's in charge of all kit maintenance and fixing it and all the safety of that. So please, big cheer for Corporal Chris Jarman, everyone. I'd uh, also like to mention the 4th Battalion of the Parachute Regiment. Uh, they're hosting us up here very well at the moment, but uh, the Scottish uh, TA Battalion of the Parachute Regiment. So uh, a big cheer for them, please, ladies and gentlemen. And then finally, the biggest cheer you can muster, everyone, as they fall out, the British Army's free fall display team, the Red Devils, everybody. Yay! And a very big thank you indeed to Sergeant Barry Loftus from the Red Devils for his excellent commentary.